Alrighty. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to a new stream. Uh, today I'm at Bear uh, because it is active. And uh, I was here two days ago. Uh, boilies with bananas is working great. And guess what? Oops, not this. Uh, I caught a trophy grass carp 30 kg on potatoes. So, hi DJ, how's it going? Uh, so that's why I came back uh, to bear because I am getting luck here and I thought you know what why not stream here because It's a very rare thing to do at least for bear Let me find that spot. I believe it's 5563 And we will get going Not ideal time right now to uh, stream because I think People are just at work, but uh, this is the setup I'm using right now. Uh, 30 kg, 33 kg uh, carp rod too. Finally bought it. Hey Tatris, how's it going? Good, uh, good to see you guys uh, tune in. Thank you for tuning in. I'm at Bear today trying to get a big carp. It is active. I'm just showing my setup right now. So I have boilies, my first time ever. I'm using banana, banana, banana and banana strike dip. And I'm at 5563. Uh, clip is 21. And the bite rate is really good. Uh, it's just that the carps, they're all uh, markers. But uh, it's. They're not a lot of uh, over 10 kg. And this is my only setup where I have diced cheese. And this is the setup I got. 30 kg grass carp on, which was a trophy. So that's why I just keep one rod for uh, the usual bottom setup. Let me tighten these up and let's see how it goes at bear today. Oh, congratulations, you bought your caliber. Oh, yeah, caliber is just so much better. Obviously, because Saber, I believe, is a 10 kg reel and now you're up to you know like what a 15 kg reel a 15.5 kg reel so it's a world of difference and I have small fish on the potatoes and where are you fishing uh, with the caliber are you oh barbel look at that 3.4 that's the biggest barbel I've ever caught uh, it looks like kettle corn or like a corn cob. It's a weird looking fish. Uh, but it will do for now. So if I show in the map, we are just at the edge of this 3.5 meter hole. Hi, Iftab, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, I am at Bear. It is finally active. This is why I decided to uh, stream. First fish, second fish is a mirror carp. It's uh, not a marker, but we're gonna catch so many fish, and they're all majority of them are gonna be markers. So, uh, in between them, I'm really hoping to get something big, uh, because it's really sad. I've been here three days. Today's my third day here, and my rods just haven't been tested except for my weakest setup where I got a uh, a trophy common carp. Uh, grass carp, sorry. I will just check your messages in a second. It's just so busy with these rods all of a sudden. Uh, the top was... 9.9 kg arctic jar. Ooh. Yeah, that is 0 0.1 kg off. That's pretty good. Uh, are you fishing, spin fishing from uh, the dock? The fishing dock? Hey, there we go, 3.5 kg mare carp. Uh, once again, I've never seen these fish or heard about these fish in real life. It's in this game. So when I catch a new fish species, it's just so cool to me. Uh, how is Kurai doing anyway, Uh If it's really hot, if the... Uh, which ones are they? If the hunters are working, 
the blue ones that we were using before, if they're still active and you you guys are getting, you know, nice Kura charts, then heck yeah, I'm going to come back on the weekend and try it again. Because that's the only trophy I have left that I want. And there is a fish on this. Wow. Even the potatoes are, uh, are going today. That is very, very good. Uh, it is a small, tiny fish. Uh, oh, it's a market common. But uh, yeah, uh, today I'm really, really hoping, as always, you know, on live stream, I, I want my rods to get tested. You know, I want big fish today. Oh, really? Well, I'm not going to go now. I was talking about uh, this weekend in real life week, time weekend. Uh, Kurai. It's actually pretty darn good, isn't it? But then I have no idea if uh, cloudy weather is good or bad for fishing. Okay. Is this a decent sized fish? I'm not sure. Holy cow, yeah, it is a decent sized fish. Uh, but what I've noticed is sometimes like a 5 kg carp will give me a hard time and it'll put out the same strength as like a 10 kg carp. Holy cow, 6.7 kg mirror carp. Uh, I think it's a good start to the day. Uh, it is around sunset right now. I believe that is always an active time in this game for all types of fish. Uh, so far, three minutes and we've got, look at this, we've got a corn, a uh, common barbell, and a few nice sized fish. Uh, 2 kg, 2 kg, 3 kg, 3 kg, that seems to be the average weight right now. All the days I've been here. Okay. You know what, I think sunny weather is the best weather. Because when I was streaming last week and it was cloudy and partly sunny and that's why I think uh, I did really ba bad there. Let's see. I'm going to try. I'm going to give my 100% to bear. Uh, before it dies down again. <laughs> because bear has never been good for me. And I was so scared of doing boilies because I just don't know how they work and they're expensive. But um, I'm happy... It it's, it's working. I got the setup right and uh, it's it's been working. So someone just caught a 33 kg grass carp on cheese, but they were using PVA and I don't have PVA. So if the potatoes get too slow, we can try uh, cheese as well. I mean, it would be a dream to get a golden tench. As long as there was a marker golden tent, I would be really happy. Look at that, another nice fat carp. Wow. Uh, that's scary. On a 32 inch screen. <laughs> uh, so in the chat, someone's... Uh, Devon, Devon? Devon's saying the alpha is really bad that some people say. I have alphas. Uh, there are the cheapest reels that I could buy. Where are my... Uh, I do have two alphas. Uh, when you're new, like when I was at uh, Old Bear and alpha was the first thing I unlocked, I went for bear. I did not go for saber 60 or anything. I went straight for, you know, the proper setup. And alpha is pretty good. Uh, you just have to check the mega sheet to see what the repair time is and how much the cost of repair is. Because uh, even then though, how many times are you going to repair your 15 kg setups? Because eventually you're going to unlock, you know, the Venja and whatever, the 17 and 20 kg reels. So you might not even un uh, repair them ever. Holy cow, what? That sucks. 1.2 kg. This fish is not paying for these boilies. It is nighttime. I'm hoping we get. Oh, yes. Which rod is it? Is it this one? Was it this one? Or maybe it's our other one. Okay, I need to quickly reel this in then. Yep, it is that one. Okay, okay, okay. 
Uh, guys, it could be a 9 kg fish or it could be a 30 kg fish. I really don't know. Not even gonna bother putting tension on them. Yeah, my resistance was a 23, so maybe it could be it. Uh, 800 silver to fix them both. Okay. Yeah, that's decent. Uh, the gold ass, my break was over 55% done and it was only 100 silver to repair it. Look at that, a 6 kg carp and it felt like it was a huge fish. Uh, but you know what, I'm, I'm really happy we're getting around 5 to 6 kg fish. Uh, will bear live up to its name of, you know, those big scary carps that as new players we were scared of, you know, made to be scared of? Uh, I don't know, let's see. I really hope so. Uh, eight minutes in and we have three, six kg fish, five kg. So, uh, so far it's looking good. I'm happy with this. Hey, Jessica, how's it going? <laughs> I'm so happy. All of you are tuning in. Uh, today I'm giving it a shot to bear. As you remember, what, three days ago, it was my first day at bear and I ended up getting, uh, 30, 30 kg grass carp. It was a trophy. It was on potatoes, potatoes, and I was getting so much fish on uh, on this setup on bananas. Uh, thanks to M Dog for that. He was, uh, I think, you know, wherever he finds this information from, or if he f figures it out himself. I just did what he was doing, and I had good luck here. Uh, the only only issue is the fish. Don't get over 10 kg. I will have in two hours, I'll get 70 fish. 60 of them will be markers, uh, but they'll all be under 10 kg. So let's see how we do today. Golden tench, I have no idea what I even need for a golden tench. First of all, you need like specific spots that are tested. Uh, G for golden tench. Oh my god, someone got it on G's? Cheese, raspberry, vanilla, raspberry. See, I'm not going to buy all this stuff because they're so rare, there's just no point. Look at this, grass carp. Diced potatoes and diced cheese. They have two setups. Oh, we have something on this guy. Let's see. Are there any burbots at bear? Because I've never heard or caught a burbot at bear. I think if you don't have boilies, you're still going to have good luck here. Uh, just on potatoes and cheese, because I've caught a few on this guy here. Mm, so how's everyone's day going today? It's, it's Thursday, it's almost the weekend, but I guess it doesn't matter for many of us because we're either working from home or, you know, we're, we're out of work, basically. <laughs> Uh, but actually, a uh, lockdown has been lifted here in uh, in Toronto and I think in our province. I think a lot of people are back to work, actually. Schools are opening up in September, I believe. I'm not sure how that's going to go. It's a little risky. But let's see how the conditions go. Something is playing with our potatoes. And I think something might have taken it. If it gets too slow here, uh, I really want to go to uh, Mosquito. And try to catch a blue trophy. I think those giblets and crucians are the easiest trophies to get first of all. And I think there might be a chance of getting a blue. But I just want to use night crawlers for them. I don't want to waste money on uh ooh black carp. Someone dropped ink on this poor guy. That's how they look like. Uh, I just want to use you know uh, night crawlers or semolina or whatnot. No boilies. Ooh, something is uh, taking a line on my caliber. Oh no. Uh oh. Not good days for fishing, huh, Jess? Oh. 
Yeah, you know what? That's how RF four is. They're so they're like I've had so many days where I was like, I've screwed this. I don't want to play this anymore. Uh, I spent you know three hours and I would hardly get any fish or I would get all non markers, and I guess really upsetting. So. You know what? You get over it, you come back, and then you have a good day of fishing, and you're like, yeah, you know what? Let's do this again tomorrow. <laughs> uh, 5 kg mericarp at 57 centimeters. That's very short, isn't it? 50 cent centimeters. Yeah. So let's put this on 23. Even at that time, we're getting fish, so I'm happy. Okie dokie. Uh, where can I hit it? You can only see the lines on in the flashlight from one angle. You cannot see it from the other side. Really annoying. It's very nice and warm at bear. Like I love this weather. Even in real life, I love this weather. <laughs> uh, I'm so tired of cold. And I'm so depressed because August is like the last full month of summer for us here in Toronto. And then in September, it starts to cool down. And before you know it, you know, all the leaves are on the ground and it's raining and it's cold and your chances of slipping and falling on your butt are like 99% because you know, everything is wet. And then we have those windy, cold days and yeah, I'm, I'm going to stop complaining. So, so far 6.7 kg is our biggest fish. We have a black carp. I'm really happy we actually caught that finally. We have the biggest barbel I've ever caught, which is 3.459 kg. Uh, the fish that looks like corn. And let's see if we break that 10 kg marker. Let's see if I can get a trophy today. Uh, it's looking decent so far. I'm not sure what other spots. I think this is the only spot that's active right now. Uh, if this dies out, which I doubt it will, we can always go back to, what is it, this spot over here, I believe. Or maybe I think it's right by the campsite. Or if Bear decides to slap me in the face, I can always go to uh, Mosquito and, you know, go for cables and crucians. I guess if you're having a bad day with bottom fishing, you're not catching anything, just go to Mosquito. I've done that in the past. <laughs> when I was at Old Berg and I didn't know what to do and I couldn't catch anything, I just went to Mosquito sometimes. Uh, that's a good spot. I think the devs shouldn't nerf that spot and just keep it there. With everyone actually farming uh, these trophies, I only have 31 trophies that I've caught. I'm very sure some people are going to have like 100 or 200 trophies because that spot pads your trophy count so much. Uh, oh, someone caught something. What did someone get? Uh, Taman. I have no idea about that fish because I'm not high level enough to uh, catch that yet. Yeah, they've been really going crazy recently. So maybe I should go there sometime. All of a sudden become quiet. Uh, the grocery store is right there, but I think everything is expensive here. Uh, the only thing I need to make is most likely... Wait, how do you... Where's my food menu, damn it. No. Holy cow, I forgot how to whip out my food. The tea? Yeah, it's tea. Uh, I have enough teas, actually. It's okay. Yeah, we go. Jess, are you, uh, are you in RF4 right now? Are you fishing, or...? What's up? Can I craft something? I think I am out of... I have milk, I have sugar. I just need semolina. Perhaps I can go and buy that. 
You know what, it's okay. I'm not gonna start grinding <laughs> my skill on uh, on stream. So making lures, I have no idea. I've never done anything with it. But it's okay, I there's no reason to make it. Uh, making ground bait, 43. Cooking is 44. Harvesting bait is very low. Uh, but look how even everything is. 40, 40%, 61, 63%. Uh, I just invested... Two points and carp rods. Oh, this is spent fishing. So I had two points and I put it in carp rods because I just started using carp rods. Uh, and I cannot uh, redo all of my points. Okay, I think there's a small fish on this guy. Oh, yeah, it's a tiny one. Oh, it's a cruisin. Cruisin are bad news. Uh, it means your fishing ro uh, spot has been fished out. At least when I was at Oldberg, that's those were the indicators for me. Good luck. Uh, yeah, banana's working. Uh, other setups are working as well. Oh, the these boat rods have. Fish on him. I can show you exactly what my setup is if you like. After I catch these two fish here. Another mercarp, yay! 4kg. Uh, but good XP, you know what? It's It might not be the best money. But it's, uh, it's good XP. I don't know why I compare everything to trolling. Uh, Rolling is the best way to get XP and money. Nothing can rival it. Unless you're, I don't know, unless you have those high level places unlocked. Hey, it's a marker. Well, yeah, Caliber is meta because it's freaking good. That's why. Uh, so let me go ahead and just show you. I'm using the pop up oily plus pop up. So we have two of these. And then the Mad Myers Banana Strike. Uh, size 1. And then since bear is clay bottom, I'm using clay. And that's how it is in these two rods. And then I have banana. I'm, I'm sorry, a potato on this one. Uh, clip is 21. Yeah, I can show you my setup, sure. Clip is 21. Uh, so it is... Uh, Papa Boilie, so I have classic pop-up rig with two Papa Boilies and the flavor is Mad Myers Banana Strike. I'm using 14. Size 14. I guess that's the ball size or whatever it is. Uh, both of my setups are the exact same as this here. Uh, clay, color you want. And then my last one is your, your your you know basic bottom fishing. I just have potatoes. I have size one hooks on all of them, and I have the black carp mix. So I've been catching more barbel than I have uh, carps actually on this rod. Uh, yes, the clip is twenty one. Uh, where as you can see, I am just slightly west of north, casting sometimes over there, sometimes behind the reeds. And that should work for everyone. Uh, bite rate. So the last two times. <laughs> Congratulations. Xander. Oh yeah, Xander is such a beautiful trophy. I got it at Wolk. It was the most expensive one at the time. Uh, it's, yeah, it's fun. I love it. How much is it? I, I forget. It's 193 silver or something. Uh, the bite rate is good. So the last two days I fished, I've got 70 fish in two hours. And I would say 60 or more were markers. And I was roughly making a little bit under 200 silver per hour. Uh, the first day, however, I got a trophy grass carp. So that kind of boosted it up to, you know, I think I made a 600 or something in two hours. Yeah, Trophy Xander is, is good. 
How many kg? I think I got 8 kg. And I think that is the minimum size limit too. I It was 8.4 kg. So. And we have another mirror. Or is that a common? Oh, our, wow, is this our first comment today? Yesterday I was getting so many comments. Yeah, it is our first comment. That's, oh no, this is our second comment, okay. Common, surprisingly, I thought Mericarps would be more expensive than comments, but I think comments are better price per weight. Uh, so at Oldberg, I haven't been there in a while. The only spot I know of at Oldberg, I don't, I can't show you a map right now, but it's at that small pond. Uh, if you go to that small pond, there's going to be a clearing and to your right is going to be, uh, duckweed and there's going to be like a hole in that duckweed. That's when you know you're in the right place. So you throw potatoes, you know, size one hook or size six hook, whatever size you want. You throw it in there. Uh, clip 5 to clip 10 and I've got several 19 kg grass carps from that pond and fish cannot run out of that pond so you are golden there yeah no tackle store bear uh, size 20 pups see uh, boilies are very new to me so I have no idea if Bigger, you know, pop-up balls are going to attract bigger fish or more fish or if they're going to scare away the carps because I want big carps. And you know what? Maybe this is why I'm getting all these small carps because it's small sized ball. But it's it's size one hook. That's what I don't get. But like, I'm, I'm happy they're all markers. Like, look at that. All markers. I just have two non-markers so far. Uh... So like, but you know, I didn't buy the caliber and the alphas and you know the gold ADS to catch five kg fish. <laughs> uh, so it's it's both. Oh, okay, bigger boilies. Thanks, Jess. What I can do is I can obviously experiment. I can have you know the size fourteen on this one, and then on this one I can have the size twenty. And maybe I might get bigger fish. Uh, this potato is sort of quiet. I might switch it to cheese. It is a beautiful, quiet summer day at Bear. And oh my god, another tiny fish. Or a carp. Can I slice this fish up and make fish bait? Because it's 1.5 kg. That's a nice size. I obviously need to spend like 20 months just to, you know, grind my way up so I can uh, make fish bait. And our potatoes are getting some action. Okay, boily size. Damn it. You know what, Jess? I think you are right then. That's why I'm getting all these small fish. Ooh, reel is broken. Ouch, killer. What are you doing? Hopefully it was a... Beginner rod. Oh, another barbell. See, these potatoes are really good for barbell. Look at that. Another corn fish. Still got the fish. Good job, Kaylor. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to keep potatoes. So now that you've put that pot in my head, it's going to bother me now. Because I cannot buy size 20 unless I go... Uh, 47, 20? Uh, Lazar, Lazar, I, I'm sorry, I don't know the coordinates. Okay, Shadow, thank you for uh, sticking by. <laughs> yeah, keep that PC cool. Uh, yeah, Lazar, I'm sorry, I don't know what the coordinates are for Oldberg. Uh, but it is the bridge on the rightmost side. So keep walking right towards the pond. And... Godwist, thank you so much. Oh, hey, size 20. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, middle raw, let's go ahead and try that. Okay, I'm going to put size 20. 
and then that's size 20. Banana strike. Alrighty. Oh, you know what? I should have put the big one on the caliber. Uh, it's okay. <laughs> Thank you so much once again. Uh, let's see how it changes the bite rate and uh, the size. So we have 20 fish. I've been here 27 minutes. Holy cow. Almost, almost a fish a minute, which for bottom fishing, for big fish, it's actually, I think, pretty good. <laughs> yep. oh. I just started playing uh, No Man's Sky as well. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to stream that on the weekend or if I just stream uh, Russian Fishing 4. And then I still don't know what I'm, where I'm going to stream though. Like what lake or river I should go to. You know what? On the weekend I have to see uh, the weather for Kurai. And I might go there again. If not, if that, if not that, sorry, I will go to Volkov because I miss Volkov. I really like that place. And we can, I think we can get some big fish and that'll be good entertainment for the stream. Ooh. Size 20 has something, but it doesn't look too big. Uh, you found the place, got 7kg, perfect. Uh, yeah, it, at that small pond, you will get a lot of carps, big carps on uh, your first day. When I come there on the second day, like, you know, nighttime you go bream farm, and then the next morning you come back, it's it'll be very slow, and you'll only get cruising and, and gibbles. That means your spot has dried out. But on the first day, you should get a lot of uh, nice sized carps. <laughs> Thank you, Jess. So what happened was I started recording No Man's Sky. Uh, but I ended up deleting all of my recordings because initially I think sort of boring because it's a hostile planet and I'm, you know, it's all red and I don't think people will want to watch that. And I'm at the point where I'm on the moon and I have to find a habitable planet to make a base. And I think now it's interesting. Uh, so let's see. I might stream one day No Man's Sky and then one day uh, Russian Fishing 4 because I do want to stream other games as well. I think that's, that's what I'm going to do. Alrighty, fishies. Show yourself. Oh my god, the potato is instant. Love it. A small fish. Oh no. Is that a bream? Yeah, that's a bream. So this rod that I have right now is so expensive. And it's not even a carp rod. This is right before I unlocked carp. So this is the FD450XH. It's only 29 kg. This carp rod I have is like 1400 silver and it's a 33 kg. So, next they have to lock all of the good stuff by level. Remember how on the weekend I, I had 7000 silver? Well, guess what? I spent it all on these carp fishing adventure. Ooh, is that a common? Yes, that's a common. 5 kg. And our big boilies has a hit on it. Uh, it looks not too big though. And our potato is also getting a hit. Oh, I love this. I love it when it's active. Ooh, is that a... that's another common. So common carps are dark from above on top. So like, well, sometimes when you're reeling it in, it's like, oh my God, did I catch a black carp? And another small fish on this one. And it's a baby grassling. Uh, someone's saying there's a hot spot. Uh, Glock fishing from dock. Where? Okay, it's okay. 
I'm getting more bites on night crawlers than my boilies. <laughs> uh, Tatwist, are you at Old Berg? I think you're at the pond, right? At Old Berg, potatoes is what I used. I've never used boilies there. So you might want to try potatoes there. That's what I caught my all of my actually carps there. 19 kg, 10 kg, 12 kg. Wow, so many small fish. Look at that, another grass carp. I should change it to cheese, but you know, I'm, I'm still getting constant fish on this, so I actually don't mind. And another hit on the boilies. Oh, you're at bear. Uh, <laughs> I can't help you at bear. I've never had luck until now. <laughs> so I'm no expert for this lake. Uh, algae is locked for me, or I have no idea how to acquire it, so I've never tried algae. 1.7 kg. Uh, these common carps, the smaller they are, the more colorful they are as well. When they get big, they look like algae, literally. Green bellies. I think, I don't know. Uh, size 20 boilies. It could be. Even on size 20, I'm getting bites on my middle rod. Middle rod. Uh, but I haven't seen a size increase, unfortunately. So it could be the spot that I'm fishing at, 55-63, is just... It's active, but it just doesn't have the, the quality, you know, the size. Yes. Uh, potatoes are working, but they will be a little bit slower. Uh, but... I think the potato or cheese is the wild card because I got a trophy on potato and today someone posted on the official chat they got a trophy on cheese but they were using PVS so I think that might make a big difference. So another common 3 kg. See none of them have hit the 10 kg mark it's just ah Okay, uh, Totwis, <laughs> thank you so much for the algae. Uh, so basically for algae at night, I will just replace these potatoes with algae and that's it. That's how it works. If it's that simple, why the heck have I never like seen this in the shop or why is it so hard to acquire? Yeah, laser, uh, I would say try with potatoes and cheese and I guess hope for the best. Uh, I'm no expert at bear. This is the one spot I know of that's working right now and it's with boilies, but I have had luck with potato as well. Uh, 6.7 is the biggest fish so far. Okay, our big boilie is getting... Getting bites. Algae must harvest with a scoop. There we go. Uh, Lazar. Uh, our group name is M Dog Gaming. It is a wonderful community. Everyone is awesome there. Uh, you know, whenever I have questions, when I was new, like people helped me a lot in this. Uh, from this chat. So it's an awesome community if you want to join. It is a family friendly, friendly community. Uh, and everyone is welcome. You aren't already a member. Let's see how that goes. Uh, ah, oh, that's why. Uh, the scoop costs gold. Okay, no wonder. So what, is algae like this magical thing that you have a much higher chance of getting a fish? <laughs> Let's over in the same group. Okay, so I'll keep an eye on the chat on the left side and see what you get. And I better see, you know, big fish here. Lakey man. Unfortunately, my memory is absolute garbage, so I'm going to forget that you are Lakey man. And I apologize if I butcher your names. <laughs> so, it is a nice day. 
There we go. Hello. We have 29 fish. How long have I been streaming for? Oh, 37 minutes. You know what? I didn't even notice how quickly the time went. Uh, we are not having a huge dry period. It's like for 15 minutes, I'm not catching anything. It's sort of very balanced. Uh, which is why it has kept everything interesting. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Got it, got it. You know what? If this algae does really good, I might as well buy the scoop. Uh, but I think I'm not spending any money apart from, you know, recently on uh, bottom fishing because 4.9 kg. Nice. I'm not spending or paying attention to bottom fishing much because uh, bear and old bird just suck. All the good fish are at Amber and Aktuba. And those are my goals. So Aktuba unlocks at level 26. And I am halfway through level 20. Oh my god, yes! I'm thinking this weekend I will definitely go to Kurai then. Because I will make good XP. And then maybe next week I can finally go to Aktuba and get my butt kicked by big carps. That should be fun. I will finally put my caliber to the test. Right now, I think the only thing that has pushed this is at Wolkov, the, the salmon. Uh, besides that, nothing has pushed it yet. So maybe we can do something like that. So unfortunately, see the size 20 boily? It hasn't brought any large fish. And I don't think there has been much of a hit on the the bite rate as well. Uh, maybe I can try spod, a spud or spod rod as well. Maybe that might increase the chance. <laughs> Thank you, Jess. If the algae works, then uh, if you want, then sure. Thank you. That's very kind. Uh, but I'm not going to go ahead and say, you know, hey, yeah, send it. You know, I need it because <laughs> I've never used it before. So I can not just say, yeah. Uh, but thank you. Thank you for your kindness. Okay. Ooh, someone got a nice common. Holy cow, 21 kg common carp. Man, if we can catch that. What is the biggest common I've ever caught? Uh, while we wait. Uh, common. 19 kg. Again, this is old berg. There you go. Uh oh. Good luck, Tartwis. <laughs> you could have a trophy. Uh, so this common carp, 19 kg, old berg, OG. You know, old berg is the OG. Uh, grass carp, 30 kg, uh, bear on potatoes. This was day before yesterday. Before this though, 19 kg grass carps were all from old berg. I haven't caught anything big at bear. Two more grass carbs, 3 kg each. Good. I mean, it's fun, right? You're you're getting marker fish and they're pushing your 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 setup. So that's always great as opposed to just sitting in dry spot. And uh, it's a good thing that pond is amazing because whenever you get a big fish, they just they cannot spool you because they will always remain in the pond. Although I'm not 100% sure now. Can they go from under the bridge? Huh. Another common. Is this? Yes, it's a 2.9 kg. So the bite rate is decent, I have to say. Uh, we have 31 fish and we have been here 41 minutes. Holy cow. That's, that's pretty good. And you saw how many uh, markers I have. <laughs> uh oh yeah uh so uh tatwist laser guys i found out something new okay you see your uh your reel here if you go on the exclamation mark it tells you 
a line capacity. If your line is 0.32 millimeters thick, you can have a maximum of 272 meters of line. So see, I have a 300 meter line. That does not mean I have 300 meter line on. It means I have 246 meters right now. I recently discovered this and you know, all these months I, I thought, you know, oh yeah, I have 380 meter line. Yes, I'm good. But in fact, I was, you know, rocking a 142 meter line or it was actually 240. Uh, so keep that in mind as well. I, ha I have a half a kilometer long line that I bought. And unfortunately, I cannot equip it because these reels are too small for that. So that was a big waste of money. So <laughs> I'm learning new every time, you know. Uh, like here on my caliber, I have 347 meters of line. See, this doesn't make any sense. I have a 300 meter long line. Where is this magical 47 meters coming from? Uh, on this one, on the alpha, I have 271 meters of line from the 300 meter. So this is 0.33 millimeters thick. So if you look at line capacity, I'm between 286 and 235 meter capacity. So, okay, well, you're more knowledgeable than me, okay? It took me over 200 hours for someone to actually say it and, you know, <laughs> bringing it to my expense, uh, knowledge. What, these things, the braided lines? Or the snake power braid? Yeah, the half a kilometer one was surprisingly cheap. Where is it? Holy cow, I bought two. I went all out. I was like, yeah, I want to catch big carps. This is what I got. I think this is the cheapest 500 meter long line. But uh, I don't know what the price of this is anymore. Uh, it's too bad. Mm. Uh, I think it's a waste of money because the bigger reels that I unlock, like the Venja, the 28 kg line will be too weak for that rod. So even though the all 500 meters can fit on it, it's just too darn small. So. Uh, I don't know, I have to figure it out. I have to see what reels can handle that. And the carps have gone quiet. We are halfway through level 25. Oh man, I still need a gudgeon trophy. I need a bleak trophy. I need these shorter fish trophies. So many of them. Uh, Rough, I don't have a trophy for. Bleak, I don't have a trophy. Chub, I don't have a trophy. Dace, I don't have a trophy. I've caught a lot of dace. Donuts rough? What? At Winding Rivulet? I've never heard of this fish. Wow. Well, we have to add to Donuts rough. I've never caught it. I've never seen it before. So. Oh, come on, fishies. So what I do is, since I have all of these ground baits, that I was leveling up with. Uh, where is my garbage one? Uh, quality 2 of test 7. So I'll just start throwing them. And I will spam the chat because I'm cool like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Perfect. Hey! Got a carp! Oh, it's a rare fish, like the golden tench. Yeah, I wish we can just, you know, randomly get a golden tench. 1.25. The bite rate has reduced, uh, but like in another, you know, five minutes, all three rods are going to be getting fish. And all of a sudden, we're going to be almost one fish a minute. Uh, so looking... Uh, Looking decent. Look look at all the fish. The 2 kg this entire line, 3 kg this entire line, 4 kg, and finally 6 kg. They're so consistent in size. You know what? I was so surprised on this rod. On the gold 80, I got a 30 kg trophy grass carp. And what that carp did was it went behind those reeds there. And it just hung around. They just went a little bit there, a little bit there, and I never got spooled. And I had no idea that was 
a 30 kg carp i thought you know i would be battling it for half hour or i would get spooled but holy cow was it so easy to catch oh uh, that was a big surprise you know maybe it was just an old old carp and he was out of energy already <laughs> oh. yeah i don't know that's rough uh never seen anyone mention it too But if we wanted to, there could be a day where I go back to Mosquito and I target all the all the trophies. I've done that in the past and it's never worked for me. I, I never get a trophy when I'm farming for trophies. The only one time I've caught trophy when I was farming was the Gibble a trophy and the Roach trophy. That's it. It is sort of quiet. Let's see what we get a hit on. Look at that. It's a nice summer day. Wow. Man, I want a quad and you, we can just go dirt roading up here. I guess we can't cross over here, can we? From these small parts. Okay. Finally have a fish. It's on the smaller boilie. Yep. That's just... Oh no, it's way too small. It looks like a marker. Holy cow, 2.9. Does it have a texture inside it? No, it doesn't. You can see its back fin right there. Definitely not going to eat that one. Zara, Tagra. Okay to go. Yeah. Almost level 26. Well, I mean halfway through level 25. I didn't think I would make it this far in this game, honestly. I thought I would spend one or two hours and then I would just quit the game. Because that's how just fishing is. When you're new, they give you like a nice lake or river and you get loads of fish. Then as you unlock more stuff, it gets more expensive and fishing gets harder because you need more knowledge. And I thought I would have quit by now, but uh, I don't know how I'm, I'm still here. <laughs> Holy cow, Thomas, you're still fighting it. That's good. Hopefully it's over 10 kg fish. I mean, I, I'm i praying for an annoying fight, honestly. I'll, I'll rather be fighting a fish than be sitting here waiting for one. Oh. Man, the most annoying thing is I have to eat these salted pickles so often. And the even more annoying thing is, you fail so many times just throwing salt on pickles, on cucumbers, and I and I failed it so many times while making it. So, <laughs> good luck, Totwis. Well, someone has three calibers. Good on them. A Colambo. All right, fish, come on. I don't know what else to do, like, uh, and go back to the camp, there's no cafe, so we could have checked that, there's nothing at bear. The concerning thing is in the chat, I'm not seeing anyone catch Kurai Chars, or Arctic Trouts for that, which means either no one is at Kura or Kura just sucks. Oh, no, with the sound cage, said. Well, then maybe it's a 7kg fish, or a 5kg that's pushing your setup. Uh, Kurai is bad weather, I believe, as I was told. Uh, it's only one day of good fishing, I guess, and every other day is bad fishing. Volkov is bad fishing as well. I think it needs to be cooler than this for Volkov to be good. Sura, I've never been to Sura. Because I don't know what to do there. Uh, so Kura, let's hope uh, by this weekend, in two days time, uh, weather is ideal and everyone is littering the chat with, you know, 30, 
kg Kurachar, 40 kg Kurachar. Oh my god, this Kurachar is so big they got banned. And maybe we can have some luck. There. Uh, Devon Trout. Oh, what a lovely fish. Uh, I don't have trophies, but I just want to see this Kurachar. Man, it looks so yummy. I want to take a chunk out of it. Uh, 13.99 kg fish. A 31,000 XP. Holy cow. Some amazing XP. Uh, but yeah. I miss that fish. I want to go back to Kura, even though it's very, very boring. There. Part of it. All right, you know what? I'm going to change this to cheese uh, because it's not working right now. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Oh, there we go. Uh, let's change it to... Well, a bunch of algae worked during the day. Yeah, Kura, it sucks from the news I'm getting right now. Uh, does a bunch of algae work during the day, or is it just for night time? Ooh. 4 kg grass carp someone got. Five kg barbel? Holy cow, that is good money. Nice work, that's bigger than what I got. But harder than a carp. I think that's what people say about barbels. They fight harder than their size, I guess. Uh, since they are more expensive fish, I guess it makes sense that they fight harder. Okay. Yeah, I've never fished with algae either. All I know is that uh, fishing at nighttime with algae is the way to go. So we will try that on uh, this rod here. I did get someone who was trying to bite. I think the fish decided not to. Could it be too warm for bear? It's 24 degrees right now. Maybe it's too warm. Uh, a nightcrawler is getting good bites right now. Okay. I will try nightcrawler. Ooh, arctic char, 6.2 kg someone got. But again, that could be Tunguska. Because that is an OP place. Oh. Uh, where are my night crawlers? Night crawlers. All right, let's let's hope for the best here. All right, let's go with night crawlers. So unfortunately, our bite rate has reduced. We have only a thirty-four fish in one hour. Uh, next hour we should get about thirty-four fish again, and that should bring our total to uh, seventy fish. Hopefully, hopefully, in the, by the time we get the last 70th fish or so, we have a trophy or at least a 10 kg plus fish. <laughs> oh, bear. What are you doing? Okay, Tavis, that's great. Yeah, I have Nightcrawler on my one rod, so let's see how it goes. I'm going to keep these two as boilies. Uh, because I don't know what else to do with these boilies then. Once this spot dies out, nothing's gonna, you know, bite on boilies. And I'm gonna have to buy new boilies with different flavors and... Hey, can I eat these boilies? They look yummy. Banana. Banana strike and they have like spicy raspberry and... <laughs> what other candy-like flavors? Very quiet. Are you, uh, Talvis, are you uh, fishing in the exact same spot? Clip 21, uh, I think I've thrown it in the 3.5 meter hole. I'm not sure. Maybe I will just cast it straight. I'm very sure it's just the time of day. Uh, nothing's going to buy right now because it's afternoon. And come evening, it's going to get hot. So usually I don't even bother recasting it different places. Always thank you, but 
there's no point trying different boilies if no one's reported them being active. I just I just don't want you to waste the resources. Okay, you're you're fishing at the exact same spot. Uh so yeah, so we are at the right place. It's just the afternoon is uh proving a little too probably hot for the fish. And we will wait for a bit. I'm very sure it's gonna pick up soon. If it's a failure, if nothing happens, then I'm just gonna go mosquito and farm. <laughs> <laughs> and try to get as many trophies as we can get. Uh, night crawlers, we have a good amount. Where are our lures baits? So night crawler, we have three hundred fourteen. Uh, semolina, we have two hundred ninety. And I think those two are like the prime, prime baits for uh crucians and gibbles, harps. So we can get those as well. Mirror carp. Oh yeah, yesterday I got my first leather carp. I had no idea they existed here. Uh, how many different fish exist here at Bear? Uh oh. Can you guys see this? Is this is working? Is my internet down? Eight point uh mirror on Yeah, that's a nice size, that's a good amount of money. Okay, the leaderboard or anything isn't Oh there we go. Holy cow, that scared me. I thought my internet connection was screwed. So there's leather carpet, mirror carp and leather I've caught. I'm very happy. Common, crucian, gibble, we all have all of that. Uh black carp we've caught. Uh bleaks we've caught, tench we've caught. So golden tench. It's the only fish I haven't caught yet. And all other species I've, I've caught. Okay. Uh, another small sized fish. I really don't get this. 3.47 Let me recast this as well. I'll cast it straight ahead. Okay, I guess I'm casting it to the right. Why not? Uh, we can try that general area. I don't think it makes a difference. Or maybe it does, I'm not sure. Come evening, I'm going to change to uh, grass. And hope for the best. And that cuckoo bird or whatever it's called is very annoying. I'll be sitting in this spot, it's very quiet, and then that stupid thing starts barking all of a sudden. It's so loud. It's, it's laughing at our misery. There it goes again. Hey! Our small boilie is getting more action right now. And the bigger boilie unfortunately is not bringing it in. Ooh, 7 kg mirror carp someone got. We have fish. Yep. Looks 4 kg maybe. Uh, what do you guys think? This mirror will be 4 kg? Yes, 4.777 kg. I hope you guys are enjoying this sort of video. It's definitely slower than when I was trolling. Uh, strawberry pop-ups. Uh, oh yeah, so Talwiz, I would suggest that you go to uh, either VK site, the Russian site, or you go to the, the official Discord of the game. In the trophy section, uh, people upload everything that they're getting. Uh, so maybe someone's setup is working for them and uh, 
you can probably copy that setup. I'm gonna move the middle rod. I think I casted it way too much to the east. Oh man, unfortunately it's a small tiny fish. Okay, and then I'm gonna put a uh, grass on and see how that works. Okay, that's great. Thank you, Tawis. Yeah, it's definitely chill. There is no tension of the boat rental time and, you know, I hope I'm making 200 per hour and, you know, I've, I set myself with golds too much, I think. It's because I'm still leveling up. I still want better gear, so I'm always... I want to be the most efficient. If I'm making less than 200 silver per hour, I'm not happy. You know, if I'm not catching enough marker fish, I'm not happy. There's just too much... Too much that goes on like that. Okay. Let's see how this grass does. My first time using a grass. That is grass, right? A bunch of algae. Okay, that's a bunch of algae. Alrighty. Getting a message. A <laughs> bunch. Thank you, Jess. Now I'm gonna have so much algae. I wouldn't know what to do with it. Start an algae farm. Yeah, that's the thing about carps. Uh, when I came to Bear, or when I went to Bilea, I went there to catch big fish, and obviously went to when I went to Bilea, I went to catch uh, the brown trout. I did not look at you know how much silver I was earning per hour because uh, that's I guess that's not the point. Or you you just won't enjoy it. The only time you'll make money is uh, black carp mix. Thank you so much, Jess. Uh, I can finally make black and grass carp mix. Uh, crap, I shouldn't have accepted it. Uh, where are my... Baits? Yeah, I, I can finally make those, so... Where is it? Uh, Jessica, other players have gifted me. Uh, where is mine? Okay, I can make Crucian mix. I can make Bream mix. Uh, I don't know. But thank you anyway, Jess. Thank you so much for <laughs> foot leg. Yes, it is. It's very relaxing. When you're bottom fishing or when you're fishing for carps, as opposed to spin fishing or trolling. Uh, we are constantly reeling in for that sound of the motor. Look at that. Someone got a 17 kg common carp. Ah, oh, these people. Okay, it is evening time, so. Cowfish. Uh, it seems rather small, unfortunately, but. another marker so it's great that we're getting so many markers just they're very restricted here in size oh there were burbots at bear i had no idea so i tried fishing for burbots when i was new to uh, bear a long time ago and i never caught anything i just assumed there was nothing on it uh, I have a bunch of algae on one rod. This rod, pop-ups are not too active. I don't know if I should change to Nightcrawler or just leave it. I've had good luck with these two. Uh, not, not as active as I would have hoped today. Uh, I believe it's 50% uh, making. You know, they don't, that's the issue. They don't tell you properly. Like they tell you, okay, you can mix fourth component. But when you go into the shop and uh, let's see here. Uh, black grass carp, hemp seed flower. I don't, I have none of these. 
So as soon as you try to buy hemp seed flour, you will have that orange mark beside it and it will say, oh, you need to be 50% in ground bait making skill in order to mix this ingredient. And that's how you know that you cannot make this specific mix. You know what? I guess this is still locked for me, which is why I don't have this. Oh, we have a bite. Finally. Okay, it's small fish, but it's better than th nothing. And another common. So, so this is what happened every day. 6kg mirror, nice. Nice, 6kg, that's bigger than what I'm getting. Uh, but that's what I've noticed the past two days. Uh, the mirror carps just finish and they're replaced by commons. I guess that's good because commons are worth more. Uh, but look how small all of these are. 1kg, 2kgs. How consistent. I've never seen bottom fishing at this level. Look how consistent it is. 1kg first row, second row, 1 to 2kg, third row, 3kg, fourth row, 3 to 4kg, and 6kg. It's, it's so odd. I don't know what the heck is going on. So, uh, a lister, black caviar. Is this for food to eat consumption? Uh, seventy percent to make uh, ground bait or carp. Uh, lister, thank you so much. Uh. Holy cow, that is to eat. That must fill you up like crazy. Holy cow. <laughs> I will starve myself and only then will I eat it. I'm not going to waste the gains. <laughs> That's what I've done. See this coffee here? Thank you so much, Tawis. I still have this 10 of 10. Uh, five of, oh, I drank one, actually. I think that was during the Sivan trout catch. But I am saving, see this smoked bream these are like high quality items that will give you a huge amount of benefit i'm saving these for emergencies you know when i have like a trophy on that's why i don't thank you thank you so much oh yeah that's a good idea asking in the chat when i'm streaming i just some of my functions start to deteriorate, like I should be asking on the chat or in-game chat, so. Uh, yeah, I'm so sorry. Once again, on stream, it's just so slow. Like it's been a one hour and 10 minutes and we have 40 fish. Okay, now let's hope in the morning it really picks up because I am not happy with this. Another one, uh, Lister, are you sure? This is it. I'm not going to accept anymore. That's too kind. Oh man, this must be really good. Black caviar. What level do you need uh, to make black caviar? Oh, second level, huh? But uh, you need to probably be like, uh, you need to be cooking at 50 or 60%. Caviar. See how much further down? I think you need 70% in order to make this. Ooh, I think we are getting a fish. No, I thought I heard a jingle. That's what I'm saying, Tawis. I didn't have to drink much tea at all for the 30 kg grass carp. I don't know what the heck was wrong with that fish. Uh, I wasn't, you know, the it for the first two minutes, it was taking out like crazy amount of line. And that's it. After the two minutes, the next 15 minutes I fought it, it did nothing. My break was at 29. It was just going a little bit over there, then going coming back, going back a little bit over there, coming back. And that's it. That's all it did. I'm so surprised. And I'm really happy that I, you know, got a 30 kg fish. I thought I would get hammered on my gold S. Uh, but you know what? 
did pretty good. <laughs> yeah, guys, I... Unfortunately, it's very slow. I don't know what's wrong with this lake. Something is going for a grass. This is the first time I'm ever going to catch anything on the grass. Uh, beluga caviar. Holy cow. Beluga is like... I'll get that fish when I'm level 30, so I'm very far away from that probably. So thank you so much. I have a feeling that's gonna be really good. <laughs> uh, the top was you had a 20 kg grass and fighting like a monster. Yeah. Uh, you know what? I've learned the last what three days get catching these carps. Sometimes a six kilo carp will feel like it's a 15 kg carp. Uh, but when I reel it in, it's like a 5 kg and like, what the heck is going on? And sometimes I'll reel in a 9 kg and I won't even know it. So it's very, very odd. Sometimes the way they fight. So whatever this fish is, it's just nibbling on the algae and it is annoying. Hopefully it's a trophy fish. It used to be a trophy. <laughs> Take it, damn it. I'm at 665,000 XP. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. We have something. All right. Oh, it's something small. Oh, I was hoping for something big on the grass. Ooh, is that a barbel? No, that's a small grass carp. Oh, that's a black carp. Who knows? Maybe we have a better chance of getting um, a black carp on this. But you know what? I'm going to eat the caviar and see how much it fills me up. Caviar sounds like a very... Like a very posh meal. Why would you be out here? Eating caviar. Uh, diced potatoes. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Uh, I do use diced potatoes. Uh, thank you. Where are you? Uh, hold on, guys. Searching list. Oh, you know what? What am I doing here? I'll just go and check out your profile if that's cool with you. Oh, that's a beluga. Holy cow, 261 kg. That's quarter of a ton. And black carp. Are they that much experience? 29 kg is almost a million experience. What? Holy cow, when when was this black carp? That's crazy. See, this beluga is just a sturgeon, but I guess it's another family or species of sturgeon, so it's called a beluga. Uh, but 67 kg, 261 kg. Uh, float catch. <laughs> Holy cow, that's a big fish for float. But that is insane. A million XP almost for a 30 kg black carp. Harp. I had no idea it was that good. Alright guys, I'm gonna wait till morning. If it does not pick up in the morning, I think I'm going to go to Mosquito. I think that's what we can do. How long have I been here? 1 hour 16 minutes. So we have roughly 45 minutes left. Uh. Let's see if we can't catch. Oh, you know what? Maybe I'll go to Old Berg, and we can try out uh, potatoes on this in the small pond. It's something. I mean, that's the whole point of the stream. I want to catch uh, big carps. So, ooh, the grass has something on it again. Okay. Okay, I think something took it. 
It's fishing away. It's swimming away. There we go. Yes. Remove. Okay. With fact, okay, it adds that XP to your premium. Oh, another common. 2.29. I don't know. Should I keep using the grass or should I use night crawlers or should I use potatoes? I think all of these lures or baits have the same amount of chance to get fish. For hours? So a 256. Uh, so what is the biggest, like the strongest reel you can get in the game? Uh, is it like a 72 kg reel or? Because that is insane. There. Enjoying. Oh yeah, you're, you are at uh, Oldberg. You know what? Uh, yeah, let's see how the morning goes. If it gets active, I'll stay here. Uh, if it sucks, I'll come to Oldberg. And we will definitely destroy the carps there. Because that is easy peasy. Yeah, four hours of fighting is insane. My longest fight so far has been <laughs> like 17 to 20 minutes maximum. And my heart is pounding when I'm reeling the fish in because I'm so scared. In those last moments, I might unhook the fish, or maybe I, uh, maybe I might break my leader, or something might happen that I lose the fish after such a long fight. So you know, going at it for four hours is just insane. Another common, three point three nine. So I did bring. So I did buy the boilies for. Oh, I don't even know how to search. What will I search for? So I do have cocoa nectar. I have cocoa and cream and spicy cherry. The thing is, I just don't know if this is active right now. If this combo, cocoa and cream. Uh oh, that's a sinking boilie. So I don't even know how that works. I think I can just go one pop of boily and then for the dip I can use that. But I don't know if that's gonna work though. Ooh, whatever. Grass is getting something. You guys are serious fishermen. <laughs> Five hours? I mean that trophy is totally worth it or any fish. Oh, I don't know if this is a 9 kg fish or like a 20 or 30 kg fish. I really don't know. Initially, they hit you hard, but then if you reel it in within 30 seconds, then you know it's a small fish. Oh man, I was really hoping this would be, this would be a big boy. Yeah, Jess, you're right. That is crazy patience. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what I would do if I battled the fish for 30 minutes and it was still fighting. Uh, I'll just look at the time. Okay, that's a common carp. See, I'm ready to be disappointed that this is a 5 kg common carp. 9 kg. You know what? Good. We are almost at 10 kg limit here. <laughs> Uh, wow, this grass worked. I'm happy with this grass, actually. Uh, Lister, cocoa and cream. I just wanted to know if, how I should pair this. Uh, you know what? Let me just take this out. Let's try cocoa and cream. Why not? Since we are here. My energy is sort of low, but it's okay. I don't think I'm going to catch a big fish just yet. If I do, I'll just eat and drink. Okay, so we go V. Uh, I'm gonna change this. To... I don't know what to change it to. Just pop a boil and that's it. Uh, cocoa and cream, and then the strike is cocoa and nectar. 
Is that what works right now? I really have no idea. I'm sorry, guys. No, oh, Lister, it's okay. I'm not asking for boilies. You're just so kind to have given me some. Uh, I will make do with what I have. Uh, I just know that bananas work right now. That's the only reason why I have bananas. Uh, so let's see how these cocos, cocoa and cream do and compared to the banana and compared to the grass. I think it is daytime, so let's change it out with for potatoes. And since it's going to be morning, since it is morning, I'm praying. I'm praying uh, quality 10 out of 10. I'm praying that we get a big fish. Diced potatoes. Oh. Let's see if it works over there. Okay, that is set. My other two rods are set. And... Lister... <laughs> Lister, you're too kind. <laughs> oh my god, thank you so much. Banana flavor yellow, what? Is that a dip? Uh, dip. That doesn't work, huh? What is that yellow banana? Banana strike. Thank you. What is this banana flavor? Uh, do I rub it on the the hook or another three? Thoughtwist, you're doing better than me, honestly. Night crawlers work. Damn it! I'm gonna change it to night crawler then. But you know what? Like, uh, it's different for everyone. It it's not like uh, we both have same fish on. Night crawler size one hook is what I have. I have sixty uh, centimeter fluorocarbon. Leader as well, and the boily line, I believe it is, is uh, is clay colored. Uh, Mister, uh, you're gonna have to explain to me uh, what this banana flavor yellow is. The old pal, is it a boily or? When I catch a fish, I'll try to put it on the rod and see. Uh, but it is 5.36 a.m. What do you guys say? Should I wait till 9 p.m.? If it's still slow till 9 p.m., we will leave and we will go for uh, Oldberg. Now, Oldberg, I don't know if boilies are going to work. I definitely know I'm going to have two rod setups with potatoes. And the third rod setup, I can experiment. We can use gra uh, algae or we can use boilies. It's up to whatever you guys who are the experts <laughs> tell me. Uh, so a recap, 43 fish we have in 1 hour 25 minutes. I can't believe I'm saying this, but today's the third day and this has been the slowest day for me. Uh, by now, I should have had at least 50, 55 fish. And, you know, every time I stream... It's the fish just get camera shy. So don't get discouraged if you have the time, you know, and you want to catch harps and you've been wanting to come to bear. Just come to this spot, use the banana boilies and one potato and you should get a whole bunch of fish, a whole bunch of marker fish. Lister, thank you so much. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you for tuning in. And uh, I will hopefully see you uh, maybe in the next stream. Unless, you know, you're spending six hours on a beluga. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm sorry, Jessica. I know, I think yesterday sucked for you as well. Uh, that's the way of this game. Uh... So Jess, is this is this the right setup here? One cocoa and cream and one uh, dip. Oh, you know what? I can change it to double boilies. That's gonna increase our 
our bite rate, hopefully. Holy cow, I'm on. 17 kg common carp. I bet all of these guys were catching these big fish or in uh, October or whatever it is. Pop up, we can use two cocoa and creams, the same ones. And Mad Myers, Mike, Mike Myers. Ooh, leather carbs. All right, uh, 9 a.m. is our is our timing, and then I'm leaving. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can stay until 10 p.m. I know nighttime gets really slow here, so I think that will be the right time to move. But uh, since I'm streaming, I just I don't like it when it's way too slow like this. Holy cow, 21 kg mericarp. Where are these guys? Yeah, but Tavis, you are only using night crawlers and potatoes, right? You don't have boilies, and that's that's the only reason why this spot works so much. Because boilies will constantly bring you fish. Unless you're streaming, then uh, then you won't get anything. Another two kg common. Uh, I can try casting it on that way to inside this 3.5 meter hole. Uh, well, let's give it a little bit of time. Uh, let's check the weather for o OB. Oh gee. Ooh, it's cloudy today and tomorrow. Okay, that's great. And then it's raining. Yeah, we will be out by then. Uh, 44 fish right now. Beautiful sun. It's a little bit hazy. Uh, it just looks like a 30 degree day, but holy cow, it's 14 degrees? That is so chilly. It's supposed to be 24, but it's the morning. It's 14 degrees. Oh, you are using boilies. What the heck? You know what? I think it might be the weather. I, I really don't know. Game is really weird. I think we're all just struggling sometimes. I am, Jessica is. Uh, you're getting crappy results as well. Two days ago, this was, you know, amazing fish. I was just getting so many fish. Uh, Kurai, for two weeks, I was getting amazing fish. And on the weekend, I start streaming and boom, nothing. Except for that's a one trout. That's one trout. Holy cow, that made it. <laughs> uh, 7.35, so what? Two minutes? Two more minutes? If the fish aren't biting even till now, then it's... Ooh, someone caught a char. 2kg char. Famous inhabitants. Oh, yes. The Russians and the Chinese. 12kg barbell. That is a very heavy corn. Uh, 42kg. So the cottage pond. None of these places have anything. Uh, Kurai. Ooh. Kurai had two fish. Someone caught the second fish and they sold it. <laughs> Sucks for whoever did it. Uh, Bear has three. Volkov. Didn't Volkov, Volkov have another two fish as well? Uh, donuts. Dura. Diane. Oh, that's a nice name. Dura has carbs? Heck, we can go to Sura. Uh, Leduga has nothing. Amber has a lot. Holy cow. These Polish anglers are serious. There's two of them by them. Uh, Aktuba, of course. Lots of fish. Amun. Hey, it's our Amun. He's caught the 46 kg blackhead. Good, good, good. And then lower Tunguska. I'm surprised these are the only fish on Tunguska. I was expecting pink salmon. I was expecting, I don't know, something big. You know, like a 50 kg fish or something. And these are all those tiny kg fish. All right, guys. It's almost going to be 9 a.m. And I think I'm going to just start moving because this is pathetic. It's morning now. It's the prime time. I should be getting fish. But uh, you know what? Screw this. Let's just go there. I'm not even going to bother. All righty.
Oh. Ouch. Sorry, Adam. Uh, yeah, you gotta be careful uh, about your setup. Make sure your rod isn't, obviously you know that, but make sure your rod isn't your weakest link or your reel. Uh, I ended up breaking my one and only rod at Wolkov. After 200 hours, did not break a single rod or reel. And at Wolkov, after 200 hours of fishing, I accidentally broke it. And that was because everyone said put 28 kg leader on it. So that made my rod uh, the weakest link. Alrighty guys, so how long have I been here? Sorry, I what am I doing? I've been at one and a half hours of fishing. Uh, produced 200 silver. Ah, that's not that great. Uh, so 9 kg carp, 16 silver. Look at that, 3.4 kg barbell is 15. These barbells are good money. Wow, 200 silver. I guess that's good. Uh, let's go to the cafe. Let's try to dominate. Oh yeah, oh no, 28 kg. <laughs> uh, when the 4 kg carp is here for like 30 silver, that is ideal. I love that. Uh, so let's go ahead and go to that small pond. Ura. Yeah, see the thing is, I need to see if people are have like an active spot in Sura. And that's the only way I will go there. Because if you don't know of any active fishing spots, you're just not going to have a good day. Unless you're really good in this game, and I'm not. Alrighty, it's 6.5 degrees. Holy cow, is it chilly at Old Berg. And after that update, all of these vegetations, see how they pop up? I never had that before, it's so weird. See? Alright. Let's... I'm hoping that, uh... Oldberg will deliver. Where Bear failed us. Ooh. Bear is all about big fish. You know, when I was new, I unlocked Bear. And for tens and tens of hours, I never went to bear uh, because I was waiting to unlock the alphas and uh, the caliber. Only then would I go to uh, uh, bear uh, because the saber 60 to me was too weak when I saw the videos of it. Okay, so I'm at here. Uh, should I use boilies here? I don't think boilies are going to work here. Uh... I'm just going to change it to basic bottom, I guess. Oh no, I have to do this again. Oh, I hate this so much. Uh, is it grass here? I have no idea. I'm so bad at this. Uh, classic feed mix. Oh no, we have to use this. I'll use that. Uh, 28 kg fluorocarbon. Right, our rod is 33 kg. Uh, black carp, 10 out of 10 is our, our hook, hook is one carp, and let's go with potatoes, potato. Uh, so this I'm gonna just, uh, right over there. Okay. Our second one, I'm gonna change this to, uh, I had the most amount of points in basic bottom setup, so that's why I'm changing it to that. I'm gonna use oh well, that's all I have actually. A carb, 10 out of 10 quality feeder leader, another 28.2 kg. This is 33 kg. Perfect. Okay. We are good for that. Uh should I use cheese or potatoes? Okay, this can be this can be seven meters perhaps. Perfect. Third rod is Nightcrawler, sure, why not? Now this spot was active for a very long time. I really hope this is one of the spots that always stays active. 
Yeah, I mean, I've always fished with boil. Uh, I'm sorry, with potatoes at Old Berg. So uh, potatoes should give us good. We have 10 out of 10 quality ground mix too for uh, black carps. And on this one, I have night crawlers. And see, this is a bug. Because uh, it's not showing my mix, even though I have 37 pieces of it. What I used to do before was throw two rods here and then go spin fishing uh, over this bridge this way for pike when the pike spot was, when the pike spot was active. I remember streaming it and I guess some of you will remember that. Uh, let's drink tea finally. I have no idea how this spot is going to produce today because it's been a very long time. <laughs> Uh, it'll be pretty sad if we get our butt kicked here as well. No fish. Then, uh, mosquito it is. Uh, how's the weather, mosquito? Ooh, heavy rain tomorrow. Ugh, oh, I don't want to waste tea on that. Do carps not bite during chilly weather? This rod is right there in the... The hole over there. Let's see how it goes. You know what? We can go ahead and uh, throw our prawn bay mix. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. This is absolutely worthless. Like, I can even throw it there. It doesn't matter. These are just from... Uh... Oh, we have a fish. We have a fish, guys. It's a small one. Holy cow, it's very small. <laughs> that is the smallest grass carp I've ever caught, I think. 461 grams. Uh, at least something's biting here. So I will take it. Uh, I think uh, Old Berg is the cheapest place to buy food from. So, whenever I remember I can buy food, but I don't need anything actually. All I need to buy is Samolina to make Samolina. I don't understand why, but yeah, so I'll buy a few pieces of that. Uh, Duga. The Sura had the black head carp. I've never caught one. I want to try that too, but again, I have to see if people are having luck and there's an active spot there. Oh, it's so slow here too. Oh, something small is interested in our lure. That's the night crawler. I might need to put a uh, smaller sized hooks. If it doesn't get active enough. So this is the Nightcrawler rod. Here. I don't know if Nightcrawler are good for carps. I think potatoes is the best one yet. Um, I'm not sure what's happening over here. I'm just tightening the line. So this pond is quiet. Doesn't happen often. I might just go ahead. You know what, guys? I'm going to reduce the hook size. 
I'm going to go size four. Because I, I kid you, what the hell is going on here? Okay, no, that's just from the real. Holy cow, I thought. Uh... So I've caught 19 kg grass carps on uh, size, I don't know, four, size six in the past. So I know you can get big fish with smaller hooks. But obviously, the probability of small fish is uh, greater. Jessica, you are right. It is a terrible day, isn't it? <laughs> uh, I only stream in spots that I've fished for at least a day or two, and I'm confident that these spots are good. So that when I stream, these spots pay back. You know, it's a it's an active stream. Uh, but it's just the past weekend was terrible. Two days in a row uh, today. After so much successes at Bear, it's just sucked. Uh, and now at Old Berg, this is the trusty spot that you can always fall back to. It's always active, but holy cow, is it not? Uh, so if anyone has been to Old Berg and, ha and knows about any active spots, I guess I will relocate to that place because uh, nothing's biting right now. It could be because it's daytime now and morning is over, but... Never, never done this bad here. I hate it when it gets stuck like that. I'm just gonna bring it a little bit closer. Anything, uh, mosquito is... Oh man, it's only today we have a good day for mosquito. Uh, so basically, when it becomes early evening, I'm going to go right to Mosquito because at nighttime is when the giblets uh, bite. Okay, thank you, Tawis. Uh, it's not working out for me here. Uh, there was recently a tent spot. Unfortunately, I cannot minimize the game during stream and look at VK or whatever these active sites are. I could relocate. Ooh, Nightcrawler again. Something's hitting it. Could be a gibble carp or something, cause nightcrawler, big carps. Not sure. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, it's a tiny fish. Wouldn't grass be like the perfect fish here? I mean, sorry, the perfect bait. Ooh, a tiny sleeper. That is unexpected on a size one. Ooh, is there an active eel spot? Because heck yeah. I mean, it's going to be an extremely boring stream, I think. I'll be just sitting there. Uh, but yeah, I've been wanting to try out for eel. I know it's a very slow fishing for that, but heck yeah. Uh, is the eel spot right over here? right over here isn't it uh and we use fish pieces which i have a load off <laughs> seven trophies what that is insane okay guys so we have to make a decision now because i'm not sure anymore should i stay here and fish for eel or should i go to mosquito and fit and farm the trophy gibbles and stuff uh with the eel is i can be here the whole night and not catch a single thing at mosquito like we've all you know seen gibble it gibble and all of that farm area so it's uh it's up, up to all of you i'm Open with both. I'm fine with both. It's just fortunate this is not working. Wow. Nightcrawler? Is that Nightcrawler? Yes, it is. Oh no. No. That spot is slowed down. 
But I think we might need to go for eels. Uh, oops, sorry. Jessica, do you know what coordinate on the map that is? Uh, <gasps> guys, guys, guys. There is a tent spot at Oldberg at 7151. I wrote this down in my notes uh, yesterday. Okay, let me write eel. Oldberg at... 36, 28, I just don't know what, uh, oh yes, yes, finally. Please take it, please. Oh, okay, 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 it's right here then. Right over there. Uh, 3628. I'm gonna have to look. Something small is nibbling my hook. Okay, that is somewhere close by. I think it might be going this way somewhere, perhaps. Uh. Okay. Yeah, it's increasing when I go that way. Uh, 53, 12, 54, 55. Okay, it's getting bigger. I think it might be the other way. If this harp makes up its mind. There we go. Ooh, can we see the fish? It's some very small invisible fish apparently. Wow, look at how they pull the rod. It's like, holy cow. <gasps> this is a big fish. Oh, it's not a big fish. 3kg. See that, guys? How the hell did it redline my rod? It's a 3kg fish. I have my break at 25. Uh, Do I have something wrong in my setup here? Alpha is 14kg. Our leader is 28kg. You know what? I think it might be our hook. How do you check the strength of the hook? I think that might be the weak link here. I think that should work. Okay, let's figure out where this 3628 is. You know what? There's a tent, active tent spot, I believe, as well. Okay, so 36 is going to be all the way over here. Oh, I think it's by that bridge, perhaps. I'm hearing one of my rods go, go off right now. Or it might be by the campsite. I'm not sure. Uh, but it's close by, so we can find it quickly. <gasps> Which one is it? Which one is it? Yes, it's a big one. The size one hook. And it's a small fish. What is this? 2.5 kg glass harp. Okay, at least we're starting to get fish. I think I might need to recast this guy here though. I need to take off that 7... Uh, meter clip as well. Uh, Nightcrawler and cheese towards the 6 meter hole. Okay, I think the tent spot is somewhere over here. It's clip 9, a Nightcrawler and cheese, 7151, size 4 hook. I think people were getting trophy tench on in that spot. So I think yesterday or day before yesterday I made that note. I'm not sure if that's still active if anyone wants to try that spot out. Uh, unfortunately this is not working out for me here. I've caught three, four fish in 12 minutes. Uh, they've been relatively tiny. Okay, let's find out that 3628 spot because it's going to be evening sunset is it's a bit far away. 
3628. Okay. I think 3628 is by that campsite. This is 36, and then 28 is going to be over there. Perfect. So we know when, uh, as soon as it gets dark, where we need to go. I can come and I can fish this spot as well right here for now. Uh, but I don't know what bait or lures I should use though. I don't know what fish to target there. I can put cheese on this and try. Maybe we can get something with cheese. I'm gonna move this rod here. Uh, does anyone know what bites in this hole? I can even do float fishing here, uh, but it's extremely annoying. Someone leveled up. Uh, Twiza, congratulations for uh, that level up. Alrighty. Something is biting here. Fortunately, we can't see it. Take it. Come on. I'm afraid me walking here might scare the fish because it's so close to the shore. But I don't think this game has that type of mechanism. Looking like a small fish perhaps. When it goes on for too long, I just, uh, I just yank the rod a little bit. I just reel in a little bit. Ooh, I think I have a bite here. Okay, so good thing we... Oh yeah, definitely, we got something here. What do we have? Holy cow, it went all the way under the bridge. What is... That's a grass? A 2kg grass carp. I'll take it. But I'm just so surprised guys. Not a single 10kg or greater grass carp today. Not at Bear, not at Old Berg. We're using size 1 hook. Uh, where is my rod? What's right there? Oh, it's so something took it finally. What is this fish? I don't see. 2kg! What the heck is going on, guys? 2kg, 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 3kg. Man, this game is trolling me right now. This is not why I bought a 15kg reel. <laughs> yeah, our cheese might be getting something. Yeah, our cheese is getting something. Uh, when is prime eel time? Is it as soon as the sun goes down? Or does it start at like 2 a.m. or something? Because I can fish for tench at that spot. So I've been here 17 minutes.
Oh, our other rod is going off right now. Ten PM, that's way too early. Uh but that seems reasonable. Another two kg <laughs> two kg. <laughs> oh man, what is going on here? I don't know. I don't know. I've never never ever Seen anything like this? Two kg, two kg, two kg, two kg, three kg. Ah, <laughs> uh, if it's cold and rainy, it's seven to eight in the morning. Okay, it is definitely cold. It is just not rainy. Actually, I don't think it's cold either. Eighteen degrees seems a little bit warm. Uh, I think eighteen, eight, seven, six, six p.m. right now. 19 is 9, 8, 7, 7 p.m. Okay, we have like uh, three minutes. So I think I can start moving now because we have to run all the way up to the campsite. Uh, What am I supposed to do here? Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to put fish pieces. Something was locked. Okay, all of these. Uh, Eel is... What is the hook size for eel? 2K grass carp. Yeah, the Russian fishing for, I don't know what you're up to right now, but uh, you're trolling us. Okay, this I will leave it as... Uh, I need to put Tench Mix, but I don't think I have ten. Yeah, I'll just put my 10 out of 10 ground bait. Okay, so I'll put this away. And my third one is... These. My first one I need to change to you. Okay, never mind. I will change it to. Okay, perfect. Uh, size six. Six watts, so fury. I'm sorry, I don't understand. All right, let's move to the eel spot. I can mirror over twenty possible trophy. What? Okay, let's head out to our eel spot. Uh, I'm gonna set one rod as the cheese for tench, and then the other rods are gonna be for eel. I don't think I'm going to catch an eel, uh, but you won't know until you try. And right now, uh, I guess this is the spot. Ah. Okay, six, four, one are the hook sizes. Uh, so one rod, let's, okay, hold on. This is fish one, we will put one. And the other fish, we will put a uh, cheese. Hold on. This is size six, and this is fish. I have to. Okay, I think we are ready for eel and tench. Uh, so eel is 3628. Now let's pray this is the spot because 36. Yep. Yes, there we go. Okay. I'm assuming it's in that opening over there. In the duckweed. Okay, that's way too far. I hope so. I hope that's the spot. 
And this is for Tench. Let's hope Tench fight here. And I'm way too far. Okay, size 4 for eels. So you know what? I'm going to change my size 1 to a size 4. Size 6 should be fine. Thank you, Jessica, for that information. Uh, I'm going to use size 4. And I have fish pieces on two of my rods. And then I have just one for tench. If we don't get a bite on potatoes for a long time, then I'll just change it to fish pieces. Trophy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for being so positive and having optimism. I hope so too. Uh, heck, I just need a marker and I'll be happy with that. You know, that's my goal here. 427 at Oldberg Fish Pieces. This is like a hundred hours ago that I caught this eel and I, I never fished for it again because I caught it and I was happy. But I want a marker at least. So. Yes, Mr. Eel. Let's see how that goes. Uh, eel is very, very slow form of fishing. So what I can do is I can run down to the store. And buy some Samolina. Uh, not sure yet. Uh, well, we have to wait till the sun goes down. Whatever the case, it's going to bite after sunset, isn't it? Uh, is there a gate still? No, there is not. I'm going to quickly go ahead and buy Semolina because I need to level up. Uh, level up my food making, I believe. Was it food making? That's going to be another few hundred silver gone. Oh no, it's not in the tackle. It's in the... Is this hardware? This is it. Okay, Samolina. Uh, S A M O L I N A. Say what? I spelled it wrong, didn't I? S E M O L N A. Okay, so 50p. Oh my god, this is so freaking expensive. Okay, there we go. So when I'm not on stream and it is slow fishing, I'm just going to uh, basically do this. Semolina is the last one I have unlocked and that's how you level up oh, with the least amount of failures and nothing that's just oh I'm out of milk now god damn it all right it's almost the sun is almost down so we will make our way over there quickly quickly let me just get this milk here. Uh, oh no, is it powder milk or condensed milk? Uh, just milk. I want regular milk. Milk. Pasteurized milk, condensed milk. Uh oh, I think it's this, isn't it? Sorry guys, just give me a moment. Yes, this is the one. Okay, great. Am I going to... How many sugars do I have? 41 pieces. Okay, so we are good for that. Let's get back and let's see if we have an eel on. <laughs> oh, that would be great. Uh, is there even a bream spot at OB currently? I don't think there is. Yeah, I, uh, not sure what the game is doing with us today, but not giving us anything above 10 kg. All right, do we have anything? Absolutely not. Uh, there's not going to be any tench here, I think. Just going to change this to, uh, size four, right? I have another size 4. Let's have fish pieces. I don't have eel GB, unfortunately. I'm putting my highest quality regular.
Oh wait, uh, for eels, do you use ground bait or do you just put baits on them? I do not remember. I remember. So how many of you have caught an eel or marker eels so far? Uh, if I catch an eel today, it's going to be my second one. And hopefully my first one that is uh, a marker. I'm hoping. One or two gram arctic bar. Okay, no ground bait. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pick this up. And I'm going to get rid of this, replace it with, uh, I believe it's grassy bottom here, but I don't think it should matter. Okay. Oh, there's a spot I woke off. Damn it. Uh. I'm not going to bother going there because uh, it's been so many times people say it's amazing uh, a spot to catch this fish and that fish and I go there and I get absolutely nothing. So it always depends, I guess, person to person. But if I guess it's on VK and a lot of people are reporting it, which I think you are, uh, there's a good chance there. But I don't know. I'm already here. I'm already set up. I can go there. If need be but I think I just need to stay put and try one spot I have two rods you know what I'm gonna just remove the ground bait on this as well let's give ourselves the highest chance uh, 30 gram and piece of fish here what holy cow that was a bug I've never seen before Okay, we will await while <laughs> I make semolina. Yes, I'm not moving Jess. Thank yeah. Because uh, I can spend the entire night going to different leads. Uh, wow, I'm actually gaining every turn. That's amazing. Nice. Okay, yeah. I'm going to stay till the morning. And then if you guys have any suggestions of any good spots at Oldberg where we can do some daytime fishing, it doesn't matter if it's float fishing or spinning or bottom fishing for carps or something, for tench or anything, and I'm all ears. Okay, that's, that's enough. Uh, who are they talking about? Losing... Amber. Oh, they're at Amber. Guys, I can't wait to be level 26 so we can finally go to Amber. No, sorry, not Amber. Oh, no, that is Amber. Yeah. Amber. A lot of people are catching trophies here. I've, I'm correct. I'm going to check out that spot. I'm going to see if it's successful. If it is, then hopefully I will do a stream in that spot. And I've very sure amber and uh, all of those maps are big boy maps so these 15.5 kg caliber is and gold is not going to do well there but uh, it's better than catching 2 kg fish look at that 2 kgs that's the number for today pike i can try for pike so this spot over here, it sometimes it's very good. You will catch a lot of big carps, you'll catch crucians and gibbles. And then if I throw out uh, the funky minnow somewhere over here, somewhere over here, I will get pikes. Uh, but it's just such a hit and miss. I won't know till I go ahead and try it. So we can do that as well. 
and eel. Uh, how long for eel? <laughs> Give me the eel. Well, I started with bear. Catch a big harp at bear. Then we came to old berg. Uh, to my true intestine spot that's always active. We only got two kg carps. And now we are eel fishing. What an interesting stream. <gasps> I can make garlic dough now. I can make cheese cubes. Yes. A 40 person scale. <laughs> I achieved something on the stream. <laughs> uh, what? We are at 43%. I can mix fourth component in cooking. I can make cutlets, potatoes with bacon. Okay. Cool. Are you using caliber at amber? Is amber the one with uh, that pond similar to like old berg where everyone is catching the trophies? Or is that... Or is that a tuba? Uh, whatever the case, if I get a big fish at Amber and it's like bare, it's all open, then uh, I might get spooled. But you know what? I'm willing to push myself back far. As opposed to this. Because I can use my 5.5 kg lacerty to get these fish. <laughs> uh, so how long does one has to wait to catch an eel? Um... Previously, when I was on the hunt for eel, I fished for six in-game nights. And finally, on the sixth night at the bridge by the pond right over here, I finally caught my first and only eel so far. I haven't fished for burbot in many weeks, actually. So a lot of the stuff I'm, I'm, I'm missing. Okay. But, okay. I need to figure out which 300, 500 meter line goes on the caliber. Because on the caliber, the max I can do is 365 meters at a uh, dimension or the thickness of 0.32 millimeters. I don't know how the heck I'm going to have a 350 meter plus line on it. Yeah. I, you know, I think you're absolutely right, Jessica, because... Uh, so six nights e equate to an hour? No. Okay, you know what? Never mind. I don't know. I don't know how many minutes uh, the entire night is. But I'm assuming like 10 minutes or something. After an entire hour with three rods fishing for eel, I finally got it. So they are very rare. You know, and there's... But I'm on stream, so anything helps. <laughs> Okay, I'll definitely be chasing fish at Amber Totris. And I will happily do that. Because it's just so much more fun. What? Which which line are you using? Is it a 032 millimeter line? Because I bought these. Uh, this is 055 millimeter. It's way too thick for the caliber. Holy cow, how did you get a Uh, use Simmons Extra Silk 21 kg line. Uh, okay, so uh, lower strength equals uh, lesser uh, thickness. But you know what? I would rather keep this because uh, you can get a fish, you know, like 28.5 kg. And then my leader is 28.2 kg. So I have like a stopping power of, you know, 28 kg. In essence, when I break it till 29 or whatever, if I put a 21 kg line, then my leader needs to be 20 kg and that's way too weak. So I think I will just keep this set up and hope for the best. Extra 21 kg. I guess if it works for you, then I should take that into consideration, right? Like you've been to Amber, I haven't, so you have more experience. Well, you know, I've never, besides M Dog, I've never really watched anyone stream 
uh, Russian Fishing 4, I just... I just don't have the time. Like, after I play this game, I, that's it for me. But I wonder what people do, like the streamers who spend, you know, like... Six hours streaming while trying to catch eel. Like, what the heck do they all talk about? <laughs> okay. And what trophy fish did you get? Was it like, uh, a, what is it, a big hat carp or... Wow, that must be insane. That's like a 30 kg fish, probably. I think all the carps are like 30 kg. Minimum for... Okay, guys, it is a clear sky and it is... I think it's chilly. Uh, so maybe we have a good chance at this. Maybe... Ooh, we can make garlic dough. We can make cheese cubes now. Yes. Oh, that is so good. Because I can make cheese and that's going to be cheap and uh, easy to make. And then I can unlock all of these. Then I can make fish pieces too. Come on. Okay. I am back. Uh, since I bought so much semolina, I'm just going to make mutton piece and I'm going to get out the menu because... Uh... Yeah, you know what? I really hope it, this is the right spot though. Uh, this is 36.28. It is in the duckweed. And uh, here it goes. Okay, 29 kg grass carp. Nice. Wait, isn't 30 a trophy though? <laughs> They're 1 kg off. Unless 29 kg is a trophy. I don't know. But surprisingly, that uh, fish did not. 30 kg tr trophy carp that I caught. Did not fight at all. 42,000 XP. That's pretty good. Happy with that. But the most experience was this uh, Sewan Trout. 89. Wow, 89,000. That's... Uh, so it is... Almost becoming morning. Maybe now is the prime time. I'm really not sure. We have different sized hooks, so it's not that, you know, oh, we had hooks too big or too small. Uh, we don't have ground bait on. We have everything that is needed. And, uh, yeah, I think uh, we might not catch it. What other trophies do I have? Catch. Uh, bear is that only grass carp? Bird. Wow, look at that. Oh, I got a white bream. A white bream not only is it more rare than a regular bream, but I've actually caught a trophy of it. That's crazy. A tench trophy, pike, bream trophy. Man. And then mosquito, I have a uh, crujan and gibbles. That's great. A river mussel. I was actually fishing for a gudgeon trophy and I ended up getting a river mussel trophy. <laughs> so that was a nice surprise. I was happy with that. And where did I catch the perch? Oh yeah, I got a 2kg perch here and at Volkov too. 1.6 in the sander. This was beautiful. 8.4kg. Such a cool looking fish. Very spiky. Even the name Xander is so spiky. Uh, donuts. I have absolutely nothing for that. Uh, Kurai, look at that. How I've dominated Kurai. Lake Trout, Arctic Char, Simon Trout, Wendy's. The only thing I care about is Kurai Char. And then, I don't know, when I'm like level 30 or 40, I will make Char my, my goal to get a trophy of. Uh, so eel, I'm, I guess we are not going to catch the eel. It's already past that time. But let me see what's working for eel right now. Lamprey. Eel, fish pieces, old bird. Okay. 
Uh, okay, should I pick up my rods right now or should I wait till 6 a.m.? I'm not sure. Wow, those caviars have fed me for such a long time. I don't think I've eaten every anything since then. I'm gonna wait till 6 a.m. and then we'll all go to the front and hopefully we'll get a lot more action there. I'm gonna pick this up, guys. Uh, let's change this to this. Let's change it to carp X. Carps. And then let's change this to size one and potatoes because this next spot I'm hoping. Okay, I'm going for pike then. Oh, it's not in my favor today, guys. This changing a carp mix. I will leave this at size four. Okay, toes. Uh, this one, I will put these on this one. Uh, I'll put grass carp mix. Or... I'm gonna put this to size one. These. Okay. Where am I? Okay, wow, our last is just 26 minutes ago. Oof. That is so bad. Okay, this is gonna be the last spot. And I really hope this spot works out for us. The two rods in for ARPS. And this spot has given me a lot of good stuff. So I'm hoping to get something here. I'm gonna put one cheese and one potato. Okay, and then my third one is... Is this my heaviest? Uh, yeah, it is. This is. Okay, so let me put alpha here. Oh boy. Alpha, you can take 0 0.32 millimeter line. Uh, ah, 19 kg, that's pathetic, but it's okay. I don't expect to get a big fish. So I guess I should put a steel leader. Uh, 15 kg, wow, that's what I've been fishing with so far. Uh, where is that funky minnow? Look at that, look at that. <laughs> Look at the wear and tear on this poor guy. Uh, friction break 22, we're gonna increase it to 20. And let's hope we get at least something here. <gasps> we got a fish. Wow. After 26 minutes, a 701 gram perch. Wow. Okay. Maybe, maybe fortune might be on our side in this spot. Uh, 20 real speed good, or should I decrease it to 16? I think 20 as well. Uh, what I do is I actually go over here. And I cast it right by that stump over there. And usually I get something here. Nothing, huh? Put that one over there. 
if something goes for our bottom rods, I will hear it. Those jingle bells are loud enough. Okay, thanks guys. Come on, not... Wow, look at the, oh my god, look at the people catching tench. 2.4 kg tench, 3.477 kg tench. I honestly want to try that spot. Ooh, we got a fish. Uh, 7151. 369 gram perch, okay. Better than not catching anything. Oh, something is going for our bottom. I heard a small jingle. That's it. Should I be casting in at the middle of the river or? Oh, something got it. Nice. Ooh, that's our first pike. It's a non-marker, but it's okay. And I will just drag it right in the middle of the river. Ooh, someone caught a 2.7 kg savan trout. Nice work, I Choi. Not as big as my 10 kg. <laughs> uh. Uh, sorry, I just need to figure out where the 7151 is. Uh, 6 meter hole. Yeah, damn it, that's too far out. Well, that's way too far. Oh, maybe another time. Okay, let me try that left side. Uh, has anyone gotten my... Uh, it looks like something's on it. Maybe I need to recast this. Yeah, something tiny is on this. A common roach. <laughs> oh, man. For cheese. Hungry for cheese. Uh, what depth? Uh, what depth? I have no idea. What What do you mean? Depth is one meter. You can extend their depths? What? That is awesome. I had no idea. Uh, I know I used to get a pike when I used to Asteroid there as well. And uh, hope for the best. I fished from the bridge as well. And I've gotten pikes. So let me go over there. By the Wow, it's so dry for me. I apologize, guys. Way too dry. Try by this tree here. Oh, there we go. Perch or a non marker pike? Oh, that is a non marker perch. <coughs> Sorry. 
I mean, people are catching tench right now. Just don't know where they're catching tench. Uh, 57, 53. Oh no, where is 57, 53? Weren't we already there? Uh... 57, 53. Okay, which one? Uh, Terminator or Crank? That's all I have. Snatcher as well. Uh, the stream does have a delay, so I'm just gonna wait. Whenever you tell me, I will switch it then. Yeah, you know what? It's been several restarts since uh, that hotspot was on. Since the last time I... Uh, Terminator? Okay, I think that's the one I have. Let me just check it out. Uh, Terminator F10. Uh-oh. Pass it down to the land. Oh no. Wow, I wish I could f cast this far with the small lures like the Kila. Okay. Uh, so the coordinate I'm looking for, 57-53. Is the island top left? Is it here? Is it somewhere here? Ah, okay. I think that's the OG, <laughs> the old original uh, tent spot that was there for a very long time. Okay, you know what guys, that's going to be our last attempt. I'm going to go for tench and I know I've caught pike there as well. I'm just going to quickly try for tench and if we get something, we get something. If we don't, then uh, unfortunately that's going to be it for the stream. I have been at it for a while. I just hope uh, everyone else, all of you guys, are entertained. Uh, G4. G4. Over here? Uh, let me see. 57.53. Yeah, that looks, yeah, that looks like the right place. Wow, I've, I don't think I've ever fished in this spot. Seven fifty-three. Wow, what? I've only ever fished for burbs from here. Okay, so this is fifty-seven fifty-three. Uh, crap. I do not remember the clip here. Uh, let me check the chat. Uh, clip is ten. Throw in the lilies. Okay, clip ten. There we go. The lilies. We have cheese and we have just our normal mix because I can't make. Okay, perfect. Okay, let's pray this turns our turns the tide around here because. And uh, this is. Okay, and cheese as well. Oh, I have size 4 on this, okay. Alright, uh... I guess I can try fishing... for pike here. I don't think I'll get anything though. Pike are usually around this wooded tree areas. 
Ooh, I can try float fishing here as well. Yeah. Usually, a few seconds after casting, if the spot is active, you start getting bites. And I'm not getting that. Uh, size 4 hook. Yeah, that is right for pike. Four. Jeez. Ooh, we got something. Could that be a tench? I hope so. <gasps> yes! We are our very first fish. It has to be a tench. I want a trophy tench. That is not a tench. That's a freaking roach. Oh, come on. <laughs> uh. Alright guys, I think I'm going to spend five more minutes and see how that goes. Because I've been at this for a very long time. I don't think... We are going to do any better or hit some active, amazing active spot that's going to give us so many fish. And another hour here almost. And it's finally time for a pickle. We have another fish. This finally be the tench. Please be a tench. It's been a very long time since I've caught one. That other line has that weirdness going on. I think it's because of the wind. Uh, this one has size one. I might need to change this. Oh, something. Oh, something almost had it. And whatever it was, it decided it didn't want any more of it. Because why not? The least I can do. Uh, there is a new team tournament available on the forums. Yeah, no, thank you. I'll just use up my ground bait over here. Ooh, what about on ground? we go let's see here ground bait quality of 2 of 10 okay <laughs> oh no they they don't pile on top of each other no they don't Uh, all right, Tatwisk, all the best to you at Bear. I'm flooding the chat with this. Oh, I completely forgot. Tench, don't bite till nighttime. Come on, get in there. I doubt I'm going to get in there. Oh, almost. Whoever is in the chat, I'm so sorry. Almost. Maybe if I change my angle. Yes. Oh, you know what? You can't go in. You can't go in. It's... 
All right, that's enough. Uh, people are gonna hate me. <laughs> Don't mind this. I uh, I think there's a bear here, and uh, that's that's bear dropping. So uh, we're gonna have to be careful here. All right. <laughs> it's uh. Okay, who's playing with my with my hook here? That's a size four two, so that is the ideal size. Oh, there we go. Oh, we have two at the same time. Nice. Oh no, it's a roach. It's a roach. Damn it. There's no point. Yeah, guys, I was saying I completely forgot, but Tench bite at night, not at day. So, like, what the heck am I even doing here? Totally <laughs> bear. <laughs> oh, wow, this might be the smallest fish ever. 58 gram. Uh, Alright, guys, that's gonna be it. Uh, yeah, you know what? I did my best today. I tried so hard. Uh, this is all we have for today. Holy cow. 2kg, 2kg, 2kg were our biggest fish. 1, 3kg. I've been here. Uh, one hour, four minutes. Will I be able to even complete an order? Not at all. <laughs> Thought was, I know I can. Uh, when I was, um, grinding the ground bait mix, at that time, I thought, you know, why not use the uh, two and, uh, you know, three quality ground, ground baits? Because I can't make the others. You know, I can't make better quality. I cannot make specific like tench mix and perch mix and whatnot. So I thought, why not just use, you know, these low quality baits? It should bring in something. But apparently this game is so freaking grindy, I can't. It won't bring anything. Holy cow, we can't even do that. We have two perch. I mean, today was honestly a very bad day. I apologize uh, for the lack of fish air. Let's see what we... Oh my... <laughs> uh, that is so sad. A perch is worth more than my carps. Uh, 3.53 silver. Uh, 22 silver for one hour, guys. That is a new record for me. I have to say, I've never done this bad. Never. And having... Uh, yeah, thank you for uh, thank you for understanding chess. Have I played uh, Fisher Online? No, I have not. Uh, I haven't tried any other game. Uh, any other fishing game, so... I don't know. If people would like to see me stream that game, and if I find that game is good, and you get plenty of fish, and it's really nice, you know, like, battle action, where you get a big fish and you're battling it for some time, uh, if it's something like that, then sure, I will give it a shot. Uh, so guys, I apologize once again for a so slow stream. I was hoping for a much better outcome. And uh, I will stream this weekend. I am I think I have my mind made up. One day I'm going to stream Akura if weather is nice or Volkov if it's not. And on Sunday, perhaps I'll do uh, No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky, is it? No man's land, no man's sky. Uh, that's what I have my mind set to. So guys, I really, really hope you enjoyed the stream. If you have any suggestions, any criticism, any comments, please, please, please. You can comment on my videos. You can comment on my, I don't know, the channel wall or whatever the heck you call it. And uh, let me know, you know, what are the games you would like to see me play? I'm all ears for that, you know. Uh, so Totwis, okay, Oldberg has been bad this week. That's what I don't understand. If the weather is good, if the weather is ideal for, uh, let's say, carp fishing, you know, big carps. Or if it's good for eel, you know, when it's raining. And it's still bad, like it was at Kurai, then I really don't understand the way this game works. Uh, weather plays a role, but apparently it doesn't matter. But uh, yeah, thank you so much, Jessica. Thank you, Totwiz. Thank you, Trance. Uh, thank you everyone else who stayed along for the ride or if you just joined in, it doesn't matter. I appreciate all the support. I, I really hope uh, it was entertaining. So until uh, next time, guys, uh, enjoy.